Hello everybody, this is D23Gaming and welcome back to another mind test video. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you all how to enable the crosshair on Android devices. Now, this is in fact on vanilla mind test, so it's not multicraft or any other strange port of mind test like that. As you can see, I got a very small crosshair in the middle of my screen and it does in fact work. So um, we do need multicraft uh, just to obtain a small line of code. But before we can do that, we first have to install a very specific application from the Play Store. So I'll see you in Play Store. Ever since Android 10 came out, your access to the Android folder has been limited, so you can only view the files. This file manager, by File Manager Plus, enables you to edit and do all the things you want to do in your Android folder, even beyond Android 10. So just install this, um, I've got mine already installed, I just have to update it, but yes. What you do is, you go to your storage here, and you make sure you're on your main storage, scroll down to Android, data, then you just whiz all the way down, go to net.mindtest.net, or not <laughs> dot .net, uh, just net.mindtest.mindtest, files, mindtest, and here's your mindtest.con file. Now, we're going to be adding a small line of code here, and set it to false, I think. So we just go back, and um, yes, make sure you install Multicraft, which I'll just show you very quick. Uh, for in case you don't know, uh, we'll just search Multicraft. So install this game, uh, run it, make a world, uh, just make sure that all the files are auto-generated, so we can retrieve that line of code. So now we go to um, Multicraft, so we just scroll up and look for the app folder. There we go, Multicraft files and then multicraft.conf so it's basically like mindtest.conf now the line of code that we want is touch target equals false just copy that line of code and then head out and then go back to your mindtest folder files mindtest uh, mindtest.conf and then just paste it here and when you finish with that you can just save it here in the top right corner and then head out and then you should have your crosshair on Android. So Multicraft will still be used for um, single tap to place, um, which we still don't have on Mindtest. But at least on Mindtest, if you if you really want a crosshair, then you can at least use this until they one day add the ability to single tap to place blocks. So if you enjoyed this video, um, leave a like and yes, get crafting, get building, and I'll see you all next time.